Hi, welcome to Make a Site Guide. In the last tutorial, we have created our home page. This is the first page you have created, and now we are going to save it as a template so we can create as many pages with the same layout as we want. Now, some people like to leave only the body area to be an editable region. But I prefer to leave the whole site to be an editable region because you never know what kind of changes you want to make on any of the page, so just leave it that way. The other thing I want to tell you is that it is really nice to type the text into the footer now and save it like that because it is really boring to write the footer text all over again on every page. So make sure that you have typed that in and just then save the page as a template. So now we are going to save it as a template. The first thing you're going to do is to select everything on this page and to go to insert and scroll down to template objects. I'm sorry, I'm not sure if you can see this. And click on editable region. Now you can see that Dreamweaver will automatically convert this document to a template. That is OK. And it asks for a name. It says Edit Region 1. Now I will leave it this way because I'm OK with this name. But you can change it so you know what you're working with. Let's say if you only changed, if you only saved the body area as the editable region, then you say main body or something like that. So click OK. And now you can see that it says Edit Region 1 over here. So we have selected the edit editable region on the page. Now all you have to do is come up to File and scroll down to Save as Template. And now it says Site. This will say the name that you typed in for the site. This is the site root folder and it asks for index. It says save as index. Now I don't prefer to save it as index because it is very easy to mix it up with the original index. So I'm just going to type tutorial temp here and save. It asks me to update links. I say yes and that's it. You've got your template. Now we are going to create the pages that we are going to link to. So we are going to make an information and about and a contact page. All you have to do is come up to File, click on New, and you can see in this window it has more options from where to create that new page. You want it to be created from the template, so click Page from Template, click on the site root folder of that site, and select the template of this template that you saved before, and click Create. Now you can see that you have a whole new page, and it is a new page. And it is the same as your home page, but you can edit anything you want. So just save it. We will save it and name it information. This will be the information page. Click save. We're going to make an about and a contact page. So new page from template, tutorial, tutorial temp, create. Save it as about. Save. Make sure that you save these files into the site root folder, not into the CSS image or template, but into the site root folder directly. Save and one more page. This will be the contact page, page from template, tutorial, tutorial temp, create. Save it. Name it contact. Save. So I'm going to close this because I don't need it. It's only the template. I've got my information page, my about page, and contact page. I'm going to open index. So we've got all four pages now. Now you can add the content, the text, and everything inside of it. And you can link them together. I will show you how to link pages together in the next tutorial. In this tutorial, I would like to show you how to place div tags into the body area because you will need it if you are going to advertise on your site. So I'm going to show it here. 
go to insert div tag and select after start of tag because I want this div tag to be inside the body area not be not after it not before it but inside so I will select insert start of tag insert after start of tag I'm sorry I'll select body area and name this div advertisement click OK and this is familiar I guess erase select layout click on click OK and give it a size of 200 by 100 pixels apply and give it borders we're going to give it a solid border of one pixel with that gray color and apply and OK now you can see that this div is here on the left side but what if you want it to be on the right now there are two ways to move it to the right side the first way is to give it a margin but I don't like doing that because it will take up all the space beside the div tag so what I'm going to do is go into the div go to box and here where it says float I will select right and apply and OK and you can see that the div tag has moved from the left to the right and now you can insert the advertisement code just click on it and you see div ID this is the opening tag this is the closing tag and here in between you insert the code of the advertisement or your video or whatever you want so this is it this is how you make more pages this is how you make templates thank you for watching and watch my next video on how to link pages bye